Fire Shipper 1000 here. Monkey's, Monkey's birthday tomorrow, today. Happy birthday. Thank you. We're going to a place. Where are we going? Crystal River. Now, I told you guys that we were going to Crystal River, but if you look in the mirror, there's a Jeep behind us and not a boat. Monkey said, I've seen some of your wells. I don't trust that axe going over there, so I did not say that. she didn't feel comfortable with bringing it. So, we didn't bring the boat. No, we didn't bring the boat. So, yeah, she said, Your wells are crappy. I wouldn't trust that thing down to the gas station and back. So, uh, yeah. So we're gonna find something to do, maybe live stream, huh? Yep, maybe live stream. But by the time you see this, you'll know whether we did it or not, because you won't see this until Sunday. But we're gonna have some fun. Yep. Okay, cue the kick-ass intro. Let's get it on. Parking area, of course. Now we're going to come in the gate. Uh, there was a rooster walking around here. That's pretty cool. Last time I seen him, he was back there. We got some paddle boards. A little exercise and trampoline. This is the patio. They got bicycles. And they don't charge extra because most places do. There he is. No, I don't think it's a rooster, it's a chicken. Anyway, it doesn't matter, but yeah, this is cool. <laughs> rooster crossing, it is a rooster. All right, we're gonna be using that grill here in a little bit, but this is nice, isn't it? Beautiful place. They live here, so I think they live there. Um, this one is the manatee. And we're staying in the Pelican. Now we'll give you a, we got a code block. <clears throat> Big screen TV. This is master bedroom. Nice big closet over there. This is big. Oh cool, there's a pelican in here because we're in the pelican. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, that's a big bed. That's a king. And of course you got your emergency thing there. Big refrigerator. Um, so we've got refrigerator, stove, oven. You know, it's a regular range. Microwave. We've got track lighting. We've got a dishwasher. We've got coffee, stuff to make coffee. It's all complimentary. This is a guest room. That's cute. So we got a two bedroom. This is probably as big as our house. I would say yeah, yeah, I would say it is. 
Some stuff here, first aid kit, flashlights, in case power goes out, we got some games. Uh, you know, toiletries and crock pot. It's a hot water heater. We have here washer and dryer. And then of course the bathroom. Very nice. This is a nice place. I think I gave like 189, I believe. So <clears throat> that was with you know all the fees and everything. Um, Monkey's already talking about man. I could stay here for a week. I'm sure she could. I, I'm sure we'll be back because we're we're over here in Crystal River a lot, and that mirror is clean. TV's clean. Everything's clean. This is beautiful. Little map thing of Crystal River. But it's nice here. So, yeah, I'll be firing up the grill here shortly. It's going to be, we're going to have an early supper because Monkey can't eat like later at night anymore. She's not allowed to. <coughs> Excuse me. At least for a while. So, no deep frying permitted. That's cool. Yeah, so um, yeah, very nice. And, and you got all your, you know, all your stuff. You know, you know they have everything. Um, there's some. You got the stuff up here: creamer, tea kettle. I think this is coffee. We got some seasonings and all kinds of stuff here. And uh, some olive oil in there, and then we've got gutter plates. That's nice. Take a look down here. So we've got a toaster, looks like a mixer, a blender, cutting boards. There's the frying pan. Some frying pans, strainer, some cooking stuff there, baking sheet. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Happy birthday, Monk. Yeah, thank you. I was just telling him, I think it was 189 for tonight. That's with all the fees and everything. Yeah, yeah. 189 They are pet friendly. Uh -huh. He cost $20. Yeah, but... <laughs> yeah. But uh, we'll definitely be back here. Oh, yeah, I'd come up here. I'd, I'd like to stay here a week and just bring the boat. I mean, yeah. it's, so, it's, so, it's not far from the house. You know, I could yeah. go back and forth and... Yeah, yeah, we could bring the boat. And, uh uh. So, right. yeah, it's too bad we couldn't bring the boat, but I'd rather be safe. Well, we could have, but she didn't trust me. So, I all right, guys. Trust you. It's just, we'll talk yeah. about this later. Look at that map. That's all right, guys. Map. I'll be back with you when I get ready to cook. Anyways, I've got some got seasoning. Let these set for about an hour at room temperature. Let the seasoning get in. I seasoned both sides. I put some uh, lean parings on there oh yeah we got all this stuff except the water was left well it wasn't left they they put it here we got soy sauce and there's horseradish and there's minced garlic and you know for your convenience they've got mustard and, and uh, stuff like that uh, lemon juice cool Okay guys, I'm gonna light up the barbecue, let it get hot. This uh, typically don't go up to 800 degrees before it's on, does it? Okay. The thermostat on a, on a home furnace, is that supposed to go to 5,000 degrees, you think? Okay, so I already sprayed it down with the oil and cleaned it off with a brush. Get it heated up. There we go. Now, I got some stuff to put on here. It's going to be good. Okay, we got some shrimp on the kebabs. I put a little lemon on there and some seasoning. I soaked the, the skewers, you know, for a while in water. Now let's 
gonna turn this down or leave the two outer ones on high. These don't take long. They take about, depending on how you want them, a couple minutes per side or a minute, a minute and a half per side. It just depends. These are already cooked. So I'm going to, I got to go rinse this off. By the time I rinse this off and come out, those should be ready to flip. Okay, now we're going to flip these. And I may flip them one more time, just to be sure. And I'll be back with you. These are going to be her appetizers. I don't eat shrimp. It's not that I don't like it. I just, you know, I don't care for them. I'd have my ruthers. So, she got me a sirloin steak. And it's huge. She messaged me from the store and said she had the guy going in back getting a sirloin for me and it's the biggest one. So thanks, Monk. Happy birthday. Okay, guys, I just had Monkey try one of these and they're ready. They're pre-cooked. I just wanted to make sure they was warm through because they were, they were frozen. So I wanted to make sure I thawed them enough. So I'm gonna get these out for her. Now, let that heat back up for a minute, and then I'll go get the other stuff. And here we go. This is mine, this is sirloin. We got two ribeyes. This is just some stuff I sprayed on it with seasoning. So. And this big boy, right? Man, that thing's a behemoth. All right. Put them on there for about four minutes per side. Whoops. Knocked the knob off. All right. Okay, then I'll be back with you. Okay, we're going to give these one more flip. Give it about one more minute. Those should be ready. All right, time to take the two smaller ones off. The two ribeyes. Give this one more flip. And give it about one more minute because it's it's huge. Okay. Oh. That one is done. Use the juices on that. that rest for a minute let that cool off I'll put the cover back on it we'll let this rest for a minute we're going to go inside and we'll make up our plates okay guys so here we go there's monkey's ribeye she's got a salad she's got 
all them shrimps. There's her dip I made her up to dip her shrimp in. We got mushrooms put on the steak. This steak right here weighs 2.14 pounds. Wow. So a little over two pounds. <laughs> That's a big steak, babe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you might have some water. So that's, you know, about 34 ounces right there. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay, so, all right, Monk, you want to try it? Yeah. It's her birthday, so everyone tell her happy birthday. What are you trying first, your steak? Or your shrimp. My shrimp. <laughs> you try your shrimp first. Yeah. You use your dipping sauce there. Yes. These are good. Yep. Mm. Very good. Very good. Good. Mm -hmm. Very good. You try your steak now. Mm-hmm. And I have some potato salad. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Mm -hmm. This is what a steak is supposed to look like. <laughs> look at that. Mm. Mm. Very good. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, we're going to eat, and we'll be back with you. Okay, guys, so we ate. It's been several hours. Um, I had laid down. I'm in a lot of pain, but Monkey laid down. Yeah. She went in that king-size bed in there. <laughs> and uh, Bruno, that other steak, he ate almost the whole thing. Almost, yeah. He'll probably eat the rest of it tonight. <laughs> he enjoyed it. Yeah. So, what do you think of the place so far? Oh, I like it. It's called Three Sisters because Three Sisters Springs is right over there. So. Yeah. So it's called Three Sisters. So far, what do you give it? Uh, a five star. Five out of five? Yeah. How many thumbs up? Ooh. Two thumbs up so far. Oh, yeah. And, uh, They've been in constant contact with me, so throughout this whole thing, when it got close, they was, you know, sent me an email telling me they're looking forward to having us as their guest. And mm -hmm. today, and you can check in anytime between one o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah. It's usually three, between one o'clock and ten o'clock at night. You can check in. Checkouts between ten thirty and eleven. That's that's about normal the checkout time. But I got a message about noon today, an email saying our room was ready. We can come whenever we wanted. Yeah. So I told them while well, we're getting things ready, we'll be there in a little while. And uh, they sent me another email that said, you know, drive safe, and they're looking forward to having us. So. Yep. Yeah. Very nice. Haven't seen them. I think they live right there in that house right there because they said they live on premises. Gave me a phone number in case they needed anything. We've got Wi Fi here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're very nice. Yeah. <laughs> so, and this place is clean. Oh, yeah. A lot cleaner than the motel we stayed in at St. Augustine. Oh, that was awful. That was the worst place yeah. we stayed in together. We stayed in a lot of, a lot of places. Um, <laughs> Mostly, though, they've all been great. Yeah. Except for that one. Yeah. Yeah. This this one is exceptional, you know, for an old house, I guess, or apartment, whatever you want to call it. Mm -hmm. It's it's probably about as big as our house inside here. Yeah, I would say so. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, yeah, very, very clean. It's very nice here. The yeah. garden is very nice out there. Well, we're not far from here, so I'd like to come back here. Yeah, Man, yeah, we we're could, pretty close here. We could take a whole week off if I, you know, and come here four days or something. Yeah. Because we can go back and forth if we need to for something. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And you know, the extra bedroom, as you guys saw, her mom could come. Mm -hmm. There's no steps. 
So no. she would be all right. Yeah, she'd be fine here. Yeah. This is a nice place. Very nice. I so far, you know, I give a five star, two thumbs up. This is um, that place down in Old Town we stayed in. It was nice. Yeah. We stayed in a couple times there. Mm -hmm. The second time we stayed in one of their. We were the first people to stay in the remodeled room. Yes. So we got a brand new room. Oh, that it was, was nice. remodeled, but you know. But the only problem with that place was the damn security guard. Yeah, he wasn't very pleasant. <laughs> Monkey went to go, what was it, the elevator, filmed the elevator or something. Yeah. So I left a shoe in the door so the door wouldn't go closed. Mm -hmm. And I'm just standing there drinking a beer and security guard walks right in. You got a problem? I said, you got a fucking problem. You better get the hell out of here right now. Yeah. Well, you can't You can't leave these doors open. Look, I'm renting this place. I'm going to leave the door open if I want. You can't walk in here. I booted him out. I did. Yeah. And I wasn't polite about it. You know, I told him, get the fuck out of my room, you know. And I did turn him in for that, too. Yeah. I turned him in for that. <clears throat> yeah. But uh, other than that, that place was awesome too. Yeah. Okay. That's where we met those people from England. Yeah. Yeah. We okay. closed it out because we was in the hot tub and we was drinking. Oh, that was another thing at security card. There's no glass bottles out here at the hot tub. And I said, yeah, well, it says no one under 18 either. But, you know, there's a couple 10 year olds here that will not leave us alone. Yeah. <laughs> but he never said anything else. So. We went over to the Tiki Bar and we sat there and we met the England people, and they was leaving the next day, unfortunately. Yeah, I think we would have had a ball with But them. we closed up the Tiki Bar, <laughs> and I was like, yeah, well, that's a shame we closed this place now. And she was like, I got a plan. <laughs> they went and got a case of beer out of their room and yeah. came up and sat it on the bar, and we sat there and drank till it almost five o'clock in the morning. Yeah. And then they said, you can have the rest of the beer. And I'm still in contact with them. I hear from them a couple times a year. So. Yeah. Yeah, so they were great people, man. True English people from England. Yep. It was awesome. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, it was great. But this place is really cool, close to the house. Man, it's nice. So, like, if we had forgotten something, it's not a big deal. Just run back and get it. Right. Next time we'll bring the boat. Yes. But, yeah, next time it's going to be more than just one night. Or I thought about getting last night and tonight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I should have. I should have. Yes, you should have. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't have complained. No. Because <laughs> I had to show her early. I was like, well, this is why I got to show you. Because it's going to come up on the credit card bill. Or not credit card, debit card bill. And, uh, you know, she's going to be asking me questions. I don't like to lie. You guys know me. I don't, even for something like that, I don't like to lie. So I showed her, and she got all happy, and she's been giddy. <laughs> the closer it got, yeah, we're going on an adventure. Yep, we're going on an adventure. Bruna loves it here. <laughs> yep, I took him for a walk. He liked this walk. Yeah, it's almost a quarter after eight. I figure we're going to do a live stream at nine, but if you guys catch the live stream, then... You guys see this tomorrow, then I don't even want to tell you that. But <laughs> anyway, that's what if you don't catch the live stream, that's what we will have done. But yeah, the monkey went and got me some fudge sickles, and I opened one and went to pull it out of the pack, and it came out of the damn the stick came out and it fell on the floor. She's like, what's the matter? I'm like, nothing. I threw it in the sink and walked away. <laughs> she went out and took care of it and then opened one up for me and go, here you go, babe. <laughs> I feel bad that you're in pain. pain I mean, the worst pain I've ever been in in my life. <laughs> I'm kind of embarrassed to say it was a jockish thing. Yeah. yeah. I mean... In Ohio, it would only happen like once, maybe twice in the summer when it was really, really hot. Yeah. But down here, it happens all the time. Yeah, and today, you it's, spray a lot. it's really, really bad eating Tylenol like they're Tic Tacs. I forgot my Tylenol, so that's why she had to go to the store. And then she brought Bruno back a couple of treats. He chewed on that for like 30 seconds. And I think he thought it was a, 
he thought it was um, a candy cane. <laughs> yeah. And she, of course, brought me beef jerky back. So, yeah. I ate, you know, half my steak. Did I say that? Yes. Okay. All right, well, ate half my steak. Saving the other half for later, and then he's got some he'll probably eat with me. Mm -hmm. But the other thing is, there's not a... There's no TV in the bedrooms. Yeah, that, that's the only There's a big mirror downfall. in there. Oh, don't get me wrong. It looks nice and everything, but I think there should be a TV in there. Yeah, a lot of people like to watch But that's TV. okay. I mean, that's not a deal breaker by any means. No, no. Because this TV's got YouTube on it, so... Yeah. We're sitting here watching YouTube, so... Yeah, I'm hanging out. Yeah, she went outside a couple times. <coughs> Took Bruno for a walk. Yep. <laughs> so. Excuse me. But anyway, yeah, we're going to do, do a live stream. I got a, I got all those gimbals for your phone that was sent to me a couple months ago. And the Zoom don't work. And the start and stop record button does not work. I tried it on a couple different phones. It don't work. And they kept telling me, well, go watch this video. And I'm like, it's a video on how to get it to pair to your phone. I don't need that. I need to know, you know, never did get to talk to tech support. And I told him, I said, look, you know what? I'm sending this back. Send me, you know, a return label. And I'll send it back. And then they was like, they sent me an email and said, well, you know, it's okay. We understand if you want to terminate this and, you know, um, you can, you can keep the item, you know, I'm like, because I can't, other than that, it works okay, but if it doesn't fully function, you know, mm -hmm. we've been hearing noises in it's this apartment. Um, so... But yeah, um, it was like, I'm not putting my, I told him straight up, if it's not fully functional, it advertises, you know, that, that it'll zoom in and zoom out, and it's got the button here, it does not work, it advertises you can record, hit record and stop record with the button, can't do that, the remote control, you can't hit start and stop record, so I'm like, you know, on the remote, because it has a remote, and I'm like, I'm not, you know, it's like 150 bucks or something, I'm like, I'm not putting my name behind that if it's not fully functional. And they was like, well, we understand, you know, if you want to terminate, I said, I'll terminate, just send me a, a, a return shipping label. They said, no, you can keep the product for your, what was it, for your, whatever, my problems or whatever, great. But it is a gimbal, so it'll work for that. But if it's not fully functional, I'm not putting my name behind it. No, I wouldn't either. Anything you guys see me do a review on for a company, I actually use it, don't I? Yeah. And I actually like it or you will not see it. Yeah. A couple of times I said, No, I'm I'm not. It's it's junk. I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not putting that up. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> so anyway, I'm gonna get ready to do a live stream and then um, I'll be back with you after the live stream. Monkey said, you should have brought your little thing to look for cameras. <laughs> yeah. Little, it's always little, thinking little device I got. Having hidden cameras and I was like, yeah, I should have brought it in from the Turk because it's not in the glove box. She's like, no way. I'm like, yeah, I brought it. It's here. So uh, after the live stream, we'll film that. You can film some. And we'll look for cameras. Okay. I don't think there is any, but... Never know. I would like to make sure that mirror doesn't have one in the what, bedroom. In the bedroom? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we'll be back with you guys. Good morning, everyone. Beautiful morning today. Uh, been up for a while, had my shower, all that crap. And, uh, sounds like they're mowing over there on us over there at the school. It's a school, a middle school right across the street. Nice school. But, um, yeah, so, this is a nice place. Really nice place. Three sisters. I highly recommend it if you're 
you want to be in uh, Crystal River, Florida area, yeah, check them out. Very nice place. Um, we didn't do the, <laughs> the looking for the camera thing because by the time we did our live stream and I put my steak on the grill, Monkey went in and had her shower and we come in was listening to some stories on YouTube and she sat there and fell asleep so uh, I was like well that's out <laughs> so yeah um, I remember in my hometown like when I was a kid you wasn't allowed to cut grass on Sunday now you are in my hometown you're allowed to cut grass on Sunday but in uh, certain times <laughs> you know in between a certain time of day on that Sunday so but uh yeah <laughs> but it didn't like it didn't matter we just we just mowed grass whenever we could you know <laughs> I mean geez you know if that's when you can do it that's when you can do it so but yeah that's what it sounds like they're mowing over there at the school yeah pretty nice school but uh yeah, this is a nice, nice area here, nice neighborhood. Uh, our hostess, you know, the, the owner, she lives right there. She come out and talk to us last night. If you didn't see the live stream, she come out and talk to us last night. We was just setting up for the live stream and talked to us for a while. Very nice lady. So, we'll definitely be staying here again. We're talking about coming back next month. We're going to throw an axle in the boat come back next month for a couple days hopefully we can bring her mom um, you can have up to four people here so but you got to pay $25 extra per person I, I get it I understand that but yeah so but there's no steps or anything there's not even a little step here it just kind of goes straight into the you know it's level so from the car into here, her mom wouldn't have any problem. So yeah, I think we're going to do that next month in September. Like I said, we'll bring the boat, and uh, yeah, go hit some channels up through there. But a uh, very nice morning. Feels like it's going to get hot though, but. I mean, it's late morning by now. It's like 9.30, but there's a nice little breeze. So, yeah, I want to tell you guys good morning. And uh, Monkey's putting some dishes in the dishwasher for them. So, they didn't ask us to. She does that. So, um, but yeah. She said if she didn't have another person coming in that we was welcome to stay longer you know like we wouldn't have to check out at 11 so but there is somebody coming in so we got to check out at 11 but if she didn't we was thinking about getting another night she got two nights here is what I should have did but yeah she uh, she said well you got my information just to let me know that you guys had stayed here before so I said, yeah, yeah, you know, we'll definitely be back because sometimes, like, and when it's like when we go fishing over here, you know, we have a couple of fishing videos of over here, and sometimes it gets late, you know, 12, 31 o'clock in the morning. Even though we're still kind of close to home, it's still kind of a pain, you know, after you've been fishing all day to have to drive 20, 25 minutes to the house, depending on traffic. It's usually about 20 minutes, but, um, yeah, it's still, you know, to, when, to where, like, if we were staying here for the night, we could just, you know, it's just a couple miles, <laughs> and you're pretty much home, you know what I mean? But, yeah, um, and, you know, she'll tell you, make yourself at home when you come in, because uh, I paid for, you know, I paid for it online ahead of time, you know, when I, when I booked it, I just went ahead and paid for it, so... We didn't have to um, sign in or anything. They was just like, here's your code. Make yourself at home. Enjoy yourself. Very nice place. 
Uh, they take good care of it. Clean, very, very clean in here. But anyway, so Monkey had a good birthday, that's good. I couldn't get her a cake because her doctor, like after supper, she's not allowed to have anything else to eat unless it's like carrots or she brought some like carrots and broccoli to eat. I don't think she she ate any of it, but you you know, so she can't have you know, so because I was gonna take one of the bikes for a ride. There's a store right up here. I was gonna go get her a cake, but she can't have cake, so I kind of felt bad about that. But that's like last year. Um, on her birthday, we uh, we went to uh, the, the we went to Monkey Island, and we we took her mom with us. So that was pretty cool. Um, but yeah, very nice place. All right, guys, I'll be back with you. Just want to tell you good morning. We'll have a cigarette and just kick back for a minute, and then um, we'll probably just start loading stuff in the truck a little bit at a time, you know. And then um, we'll hit the road. So drive 20 minutes back home. <laughs> so, all right, guys, I'll be back with you. Okay, everyone, we're back home. Yep. Shea Bear, the <laughs> legend. <laughs> We're home. <laughs> Did you have fun? Yeah, I had fun. Good mm -hmm. birthday? Yeah, good birthday. Good birthday food? Oh, yeah, good birthday food. <laughs> good place to stay. Yeah, it was really nice. She was a very nice lady. I yeah. really liked it there. And I like how it's close and we can go back. Yeah, oh, yeah, we're definitely going back, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, probably next month, huh? Yeah, we'll take the boat definitely next month. Yeah, yeah, we'll take the boat. We'll spend a couple nights this time. We'll take your mom. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. She'll like that place. Yeah. Yeah. Um, there's like sitting in the botanical gardens, huh? Yep. Very nice. Mm-hmm. Very, Very nice. clean. So, anyway, that was her birthday trip. Yep. Thank you, babe. You're welcome. So now she she got sick. I've been sick, yeah. So, but she didn't let it bring her down, did you? No. <laughs> Dosed myself up. <laughs> That's all you can do. Yeah, but you had a great time with all in all, right? Yep, I had a great time. It was relaxing. That's what I needed, relaxing. All right. Okay, so with that being said, Shea Bear, the Myth Man Legend, I'm gone for now. Thanks for watching, everyone. Appreciate it. Thanks for all the the monkey birthday wishes. Yep, thank you, everyone. We appreciate it. And we'll see you in the next one, huh, Monk? Oh, yeah. Right. We'll be doing one soon. Yeah. We'll, we'll go back there again. This time we'll take the boat and go back into some different channels. Yeah. Maybe head out to golf a little bit. Mm hmm A few miles. That'd be fun. Yeah, as mm -hmm. long as the water's not rough. <laughs> well, we, we got a tiny vessel. Waves. No, we're not jumping waves in the duo. I like jumping the waves. I started burning them. <laughs> she loves jumping the waves. It's like being on a roller coaster. It's fun. <laughs> that other one liked it. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It was out of the water more than it was in the water. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we were going up. We were in the air a lot. Yeah, when you hear that engine revving up, yeah, you know the whole boat's out of the water. <laughs> right, that's probably why some of the rivets went. Well, they didn't go. Just the one was leaking. Mm. But, so, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next one. Bye-bye, guys. Take care. Bye, y'all.